This thing on. <laughs> Tag, you're it. <laughs> hey guys, welcome to Farm Alarm. My name is Tracy. I'm Ashley. We've been tagged by the Simple Rugged Path. So there's there's a series of uh, tag garden videos going around. Is that what it's called? The Garden Tag. <laughs> and we've been tagged, like like Ashley said, by the Simple Rugged Path. And uh, stick to the end of this video, and we will tell you if Ooh. you're tagged or not. So we have five questions that we have to answer and we're going to answer those questions for you now. <laughs> Our first question is why do we garden? <laughs> Our first question is why do we garden? We've been here on this land for like five years and before that we lived in the city less than 10,000 people. We didn't garden. We ate the, the SAD diet, the standard American diet and uh, I actually weighed like 300 pounds. Yes. I was a big boy. <laughs> and we came out here and we decided, man, I'd really like to, or you know, that we wanted to get into uh, growing our own food, and, and that's what this whole journey is about. And and all of these uh, videos of these people on YouTube that are, are doing this uh, homesteading thing, this modern homesteading, you know, it, it's all about sustainability and, and what you can uh, grow yourself and eat eat for yourself instead of just being uh, pumped full of of the old McDonald's and uh, everything else uh, that that the world has to offer. Long story short is. Uh, we do this so we can put good nutritious food um, into our body so we know what we know what kind of food that we've got if we grow it ourselves and also it gives us an appreciation and all the hard work there is going into this food that we're going to eat and we know that it's good for us second question is why do we youtube well it's it's kind of a fun family deal that we do together you know it uh, we enjoy doing things on the farm and so we want you guys to follow us along and we can teach you things that you might not know on how to do certain things how to take care of your blackberries how to do this how to do that and it's just it's just nice to be able to share that information with you guys yeah not that we know everything but you know the little chunks of information that we know if we can uh, you know get that out there to somebody uh, that would be very appreciative of them I'm sure just as on the, on the flip side of that you know we're watching YouTube for uh, for learning different things uh, that we that we do here as well so I think it's a good little community of people question number three how long have you been gardening well basically like we said we've been here for five years so the when we got here and I think it was like May uh, we got my grandpa's tractor and uh, a disc and we we broke ground so pretty much just as long as we've we've been living here uh, but that's that's just us personally um, you know I grew up in this area and so I've been familiar with this kind of lifestyle um, you know my entire 30 some years the fourth question is what do we grow it all started with blackberries <laughs> we uh, decided we wanted to grow blackberries because we thought it would be a fun little project and then we planted fruit trees. We have a wide variety. We have apple, pear, cherry, peach. and peach. We have peach trees as well. Um, then we decided we wanted a bigger garden. We do the Back to Eden style garden. And then we built the greenhouse. Yeah, so you see in the greenhouse right now, and it's winter time, it's snow on the ground. And we've got a little bit of heat plumbed in from our wood stove that heats the house. And so during the winter time, we're still growing in this greenhouse. You know, pretty much all year round, we can grow in this thing unless it gets super hot. Um, but there's still a few things we can grow in here during the heat of the, the summer. But right now, um, it's March, and we've got, I mean, this thing is just full of lettuces, um, some radishes, and uh, it seems like we're growing dill uh, year <laughs> round right here. This is some awesome stuff. We had that on all of our salads and uh, different dips that we might make here and there. but. Uh, but like Ashley said, we got into this whole thing out here with blackberries and uh, it started with one row and then uh, maybe like a month later, it start, then that turned into two rows because we went back to our friend that grows those blackberries and here we are five years later and now we have uh, five 80 foot rows of thornless tame uh, Apache blackberries and we've got, my, my dad's got two rows down at his house that we planted that's uh, the same length. We also have cilantro growing in our greenhouse. We love limes and cilantro with our chips and salsa. If you haven't tried it, we recommend it. <laughs> it's delicious. And the last question, what is your favorite thing to grow? I think my favorite thing to grow would probably be two different categories. Uh, one is going to be the Achicha cucumbers that we have been growing for the last couple of years. We originally got those from Zach Bauer, um, American Homestead, and uh, 
he had got, I, I'm not sure where he got those seeds, but they were they were pretty tough to track down um, for the strain or the the, uh, the genes or the genetic, genetics of the, of the type of cucumber that he got. And if you're not familiar with those, we'll leave a little link right here of showing you some that we grew. But they're just, uh, they're a tiny little cucumber. Um, they've got little spikes, real long haired spikes all over them. Um, they're soft, they're easy to eat, and they're, they're really neat. But we grow those, we've grown those in the greenhouse, we've grown them outside, they do excellent. But my second thing that I really love to grow is lettuce. And right now is my favorite growing season uh, during the winter because you, you're, you have a lot less pressures uh, such as different bugs and, and such. Uh, you know, you don't have to do anything as far as pest control. Um, during the winter time in this greenhouse anyway and so kale and spinach would probably be um, my favorite just because we, we eat a lot of salads. Alright so now who are we tagging in this video? Since we're in the theme of a greenhouse um, we're going to continue with that theme of house and Jake and Becky at White House on the Hill you're it <laughs> and Sam and Laura over at Teal House Farm so you guys are also it and we encourage you, our viewers, to go check out their channels. That would be uh, White House on the Hill. Here's a link to that right here. And also uh, Teal House Farm and another link to them right there. We'll put all those links in the description below. We really appreciate being tagged by the Simple Rugged Path. We'll also leave the link to their channel in the description below. Be sure to check them out as well. Well, thanks a lot, guys, and uh, we'll see you on the next video.